With the VEX Robotics competition, we've come a long way. At our first ever world championship, the first game we played, Bridge Battle, it was almost homemade to a certain degree. There was slabs of plywood on the field that we just painted white. We actually wanted a black tennis ball in the game, so we sharpied the tennis balls black ourselves. And we could do that because there was only a couple events in a couple cities. When these teams come to VEX Worlds, we have a refined finished product, but there was a lot of steps in between to get there. All the way back in 2008, what we learned actually mentoring kids was what really got us passionate about doing all this. We started teaching kids and showing them about robotics and STEM, and we saw such a huge change in the kids' lives and what they did that we wanted to figure out how to take this to all the high schools in the country, figure out how everyone could benefit from this kind of mentorship, this kind of STEM learning. We felt by creating VEX Robotics that we could actually create a platform that's scalable and a program that's scalable to every high school in the nation. And that's what was important to us, is to reach every kid. When I first got involved with VEX, we had one product line supporting one competition. Fast forward 10 years later, we have three full-blown product lines supporting three competitions with competitors at the elementary all the way to the university level. We're at the World Championship. We have more robots competing than we had people in attendance 10 years ago. To think that we started with a couple hundred teams and now it's over 16,000 and approaching 20,000 and it's going to fly by 20,000 teams in over 40 countries around the world and it's been incredible to see and the energy of the kids, the excitement of the kids, the pride of the mentors and the teachers and the parents and seeing what the kids are accomplishing, it's become the Olympics of STEM education. I think the Robotics Education and Competition Foundation has done an incredible job of making this more than just a robotics competition. During the last 10 years, we have been able to create internships for our students, raise money for scholarships, and connect them with industry leaders. The timing is perfect because the students who started with our program 10 years ago are ready to enter the workforce. These early students are giving back to the program. They're serving as event partners for us currently, and they're reaching out to the next generation of engineers that are going to follow in their footsteps. And they look back and remember everybody who helped them along the way made a difference in their lives. If you have any future and wanting to be some kind of engineer, this is where you need to start. It really gives you a basis on creativity, engineering. It's really gotten me to figure out problem solving the most. Whereas instead of just diving in and going, oh, I have a solution, it helped me to find steps and go along the way and bring me to a better solution and maybe even a completely different one than I thought I was going to start with. So for me, this was the best place to be. Being able to participate in VEX Robotics during high school was really great for me. It really developed my love for engineering and robotics in particular. And it's a really great way for people like myself to really get interested in STEM and to stay interested in STEM. For me personally, the reason I got involved in this was working with these kids and seeing the impact it had on their life. We weren't really teaching them science and technology, we were teaching them life lessons. You know, dedication, teamwork, you know, how to just drive yourself to, an, to a solution. And so that's really impacted them probably more than the science and technology part of it. Personally for me, I saw how much I changed as an engineer mentoring kids. I knew how much they changed, but that just gave us so much motivation that this was really doing a lot more than we thought it was. And we see these kids years later, and they're now leaders in their industry, and they're the kids doing all the innovation like we were back then. So they all have grown to levels we never would have guessed. 10 years from now, the students who first started this program will be 20 years away from their experience in VEX. They're gonna be the leaders. They're gonna be the presidents, the CEOs, the politicians, and everything that we've been trying to teach, they're gonna be teaching it on a wide scale. So when we talk about a worldwide culture change, it's gonna happen. Especially thinking of our humble roots back in a garage, but to think that we created something that started so small and has now hit it where we're wide-scale, mainstream, and the whole world's watching. It's uh, pretty amazing. <laughs>